Ahankara feels very inflated by possessions. So you have heard the word I, I spoke of I, and then there's another word which is related to I that is called my. So in Sanskrit we have the word aham, from we have that we have ahankara, and then there is a mama. So I and my. So my gives strength to I. Therefore we are all the time trying to possess things. Whether we are trying to possess human beings, possess material objects around us, that makes us feel strong. You know, people accumulate so many things that they cannot even keep it in their own house, the rent place to store it. So why are they doing it? They are never, never going to use it. And this gives them sense of I, that I am great, I am strong, I am powerful. So this is this possessiveness is also characteristic and parents can be very possessive of children, wife can be very possessive of the husband and so on. So then the love or the loving relationship which is meant to give freedom actually binds you with a chain and makes you the prisoner. So this is also the problem of Ahankara. You are all mine, you cannot look at anyone else. Jasika has written a poem about the client. Okay, so case study, Jealous Jane from Geneva. Jane, Jane, she had a one-track brain. For all she could think about was her gain. She would hurt others so she could attain. She caused herself and others a lot of pain. Some say she was undeniably insane. There was nothing about her that was simple or plain. You be the judge. What do you think of Jane's domain? <laughs> 